Welcome back. Shot Clock is an all new book written by author Justin A. Reynolds and NBA All-Star Karan Butler. So happy to have them both with us today. Justin, tell us more about this book. Yeah, so Shot Clock is, is a, a book about community and about rallying together. Uh, there's a tragedy that kind of happens at the outset of the book. Uh, and rather than it just be a book about social justice, it's also a book about um, how uh, people can kind of come together to help other people um, in their community, especially young people, um, reach their dreams and reach their full potential. Um, it's a book about mentorship and about how we can uh, help each other through not just programs um, and resources, but by being physically present and active and engaged in our local communities and uh, by showing up for young people. Karan, as an NBA All-Star and assistant coach, what made you want to participate in this book? Uh, I think uh, the best innovation is collaboration. And the reason why uh, we did this together is because our large platforms that we have to connect and inspire um, people, um, young people, older people, uh, everyone from all different walks of life. And I thought it was great just to come together and just tell stories that's um, really now um, that, you know, if you put in the hands of readers, not just young readers, but any readers, uh, they would love, they would connect to, they would have empathy, they would have hope, they would have belief, and they walk away uh, from the story with a, a deep message to share with the world. Justin, what brought you and Karan together to start working on this book project? We had uh, heard that uh, each other was kind of looking for a spark, that there was an idea about creating a series uh, that was focused on young people and about inspiring them to to reach for the stars um, despite perhaps having limited resources or limited opportunities available directly in their community. And so when Karan and I came together and we kind of started talking about our vision, we realized that it was a shared vision that we both had um, an idea that that kind of aligned just automatically. It was it was a lot of chemistry right from the beginning because we both wanted to kind of more so than just write a book that we found compelling and engaging, we really saw the book as kind of an opportunity to get in front of young people as a, as a tool to kind of get, uh, to put in their hands physically, but also to say, hey, we see you and that you're important, you matter to us, and that we want to help lend our voice until you can go ahead and use your voice as well um, to talk about the things that ail you, but also the things that, that uh, you believe in, that you have hope in, and that you aspire to be. Karan, this is a book about tragedy. What age group is it targeted at? Who do you think should be reading this book? Uh, middle grade, but I, I would have to say this. Um, the realities of the world is, you know, if you turn on the television, if you have access to any mobile device or anything like that, you're ex exposed to what it is in real time. Um, the, the fact of the matter is, it is uh, political influence amongst kids. It is, you know, lives being lost that, you know, kids experience. And these are all the things that we talk about in the book. It's the realities. And I think it's current. Uh, when I was growing up, <clears throat> I used to pivot from reading books that didn't relate to me. Um, and People thought I had a problem with learning, but it was just I couldn't connect or identify with nothing I was reading. And in this space with Shot Clock is something totally different. And anyone can connect uh, with it and to it, and it's real. It's our reality. Justin, what is it about this particular story that needs to be read now in this time? So this story is about uh, Tony, who's at the center of it. And ordinarily, a sports story, a sports book would be about someone trying to make the team against all odds and then leading them to an improbable championship win. But this is actually kind of a, a story that takes a different approach, a different tack. It's a story about someone who actually does not make the team and uh, initially feels like his hope is not only uh, deferred, but shattered altogether. And he finds another way to be a part of the team, thanks to the mentorship of Coach James, who takes Tony under his wing and says, hey, Maybe your initial dream didn't work out about being on the team, about being a part of that 15-person squad, but what if you were the statistician and used your love for science and math to help us uh, gain victories from the sidelines? And so that's the messaging that we found to be really important because, let's face it, most people don't make the team, right? Most people don't go on to have the kind of career 
um, that that uh, Karan had and play at a high level professionally. And so for the rest of us, uh, we need to have stories that also inspire us, but also show us how we can still be part of the game. We can still be part of a team and we can still make contributions that are meaningful. Karan, this is a book that you wish you would have had and would have read when you were younger. How do you hope that readers will connect with it today? Yeah, and, and we are also, uh, and, and, and the beauty of, you know, the dream and the vision is to get in front of young people, um, not just the book, but us as well, to talk and connect with them, because I think that speaks volumes and it just amplifies the, the whole messaging. And we've been enjoying it, this whole uh, book tour. We've been going to schools, uh, talking to people, and that's been the dream. Uh, it, it really has, and we're just so grateful for this opportunity. Shot Clock is available where all books are sold. Thank you so much, Cron Butler and Justin A. Reynolds for joining us today. Really appreciate your time and excited about this new book. Congratulations. And this is a story that we all need to read. So thanks so much for being here. We'll be back with more right after this.